All right, hey everyone, Riley here from becominganelectrician.com. In this video, I wanna to talk to you about how to strip the jacket off of uh, your wire. So this is like house wire, your NMD 90, okay? Now, I just released a video about my favorite knife as an electrician. I like an X-Acto knife. As I said, a knife is one of those things that's always up for debate with electricians. You gotta be very careful with an X-Acto knife and I'll show you uh, how to be careful and how to strip your wire very well in this video, okay? So before we get into the video, definitely check out my free book I have for you guys as apprentice electricians. Just go to becominganelectrician.com forward slash subscribe and you can download my free book for apprentice electricians, okay? So the first thing to say before you strip your wire, so again, let's say we are in a residential setting. Imagine my hand as a stud. What you wanna do is you want to have a service loop, okay? So what this is, is if anything happens to your wire, so for example, imagine this is in the box. If the drywaller comes and nicks it with their, uh, you know, with their router, uh, you are able to pull the wire into the box, okay? So you always wanna have a service loop. You don't wanna have a huge service loop like this, but you just wanna have uh, just a little service loop, okay? So again, imagine my hand is the stud and uh, you have a little service loop. And then what I would do is, let's say this is the box, I wanna strip from there, okay? So I keep my thumb here. And then again, I'm gonna take my X-Acto knife. Now again, this one is brand new, so I gotta be very careful because it's very sharp. But uh, the golden rule is do not put it out super far. So something like this, okay? Now, when I do this, I am not putting it through the wire. I am scoring the wire, okay? So from here, and so what I do is I put my two fingers underneath, I put my thumb about here. It allows me to guide, and again, I am just gently scoring it, very, very gently, okay? So I am not going through so this right here is called the jacket. Inside the jacket is the conductors, okay? And then as soon as I get to the end, that is where you can put your knife in and you cut, all right? But what this is gonna do is check this out. So when you pull it, it's gonna go very, very easy, okay? And then what I would do is you just do this, okay? So again, always be careful of your fingers, but if this was stapled to a stud, cut it, it wouldn't fall, okay? Because it would have been stapled to a stud. So the wire is just dangling there. Now you can easily just put this into a box, okay? And so that's it, right? You have your little service loop, you've stripped it, you put it into the box, and that is how I strip uh, NMD wire, okay? With an X-Acto knife. You gently score it, that way you are not compromising the wire at all up here, and once you get down there, you can uh, put your knife in, you go a little harder, it cuts through, then you can just pull the jacket away. And so there you guys go. So that's how you strip wire. So again, check out my other video about my favorite knife as, a, as an electrician. It's this Milwaukee, it's an 18 millimeter snap knife. It was always just really nice in my side pocket. Uh, you gotta be really careful because they are very sharp. Uh, a lot of electricians, like I said, everyone has their own opinions when it comes to knives. But this is what I have always enjoyed uh, in my 10 years of being an electrician. Uh, you just gotta be careful. And if you are careful and know what you're doing, it allows you to strip your wire really easy. It also allows you to be really versatile when you have to cut other things on the job site, such as like if you know if you get a delivery and, and stuff like that, okay? So that's how you strip wire. If you guys have any questions, you guys can leave your comments below. And uh, again, don't forget about my free book I have for you guys. You can download it by going to becominganelectrician.com forward slash subscribe. It is a book for apprentice electricians teaching you some valuable tips when I was becoming a journeyman, okay? Thanks for checking out the video. I'll talk to you in the next one.